Okay, <clears throat> so the light out here in the shop isn't the best for showing this off, but I wanted to at least get this video out there of this mod holder I'm working on. It's uh, 12 inches deep by 24 wide. Uh, it has box joints throughout, and then we have some felted drawers with box joints on them as well. Uh, you'll notice I haven't put uh, pull handles on them or anything because we're still in the design phase of this. Um, and I wanted to put this out there to, to get some ideas of what we're looking at. Now, the top three boards you see there, uh, this is actually, it's made of Sapelli, uh, Walnut, and Maple. Uh, the top three boards have not been glued on because I'm still trying to decide exactly how I want to do that. Uh, what I was thinking was for the front section here, we'd do drip tips, a whole bunch of drip tips, some 510 connectors for tanks, maybe batteries, and then you can get a whole boatload of mods up there uh, with doing something like that. The other idea that was brought to my attention was to maybe try to tilt this and do the mods at an angle. I don't know that I care for that idea. Um, only because I don't know that this would look nearly as well with it. My other thought was on placing these boards up here was instead of going all the way to the edge with it, was maybe cutting them a little shorter on either end and put it like that. And then that way it'll show off those box joints a little bit more. And then we can also run the drip tips down the side just to kind of add some more to that. Um, another thing we could do, if we wanted to maybe add some juice, some spaces for some juice bottles, is I could add another piece of maple up top here and have the mods here, batteries, juice, 510 connectors, and then drip tips. Uh, so that's the thought in it now. Um, before we talk price just to let you all know I have over $225 in materials in this already and 20 hours worth of labor and I expect I'm gonna put another 20 into it so it's not gonna be a, a $65 mod holder <laughs> um, but yeah I'm, I'm expecting uh, we'll have about 225 to 250 in, in parts and then maybe 40 hours of labor but you all know me I I work dirt cheap. I work for beer, right? There we go. So that's it for now. If you have any ideas uh, or thoughts on this, uh, or maybe even something you'd like, you can leave a comment in the comment section below or email me, mark at markspens.com. Uh, I can you know, certainly do something like that. But this, this has been an interesting project, and I'll post up there once I get it completely done and, and let you see the finished product. Thank you.